I love hunting, whether it be rifle or, or bow hunting and being out in the woods at different times of the year in the scenery and in the weather and conditions and putting in the time, being out here, whether you're picking up your rifle or whether you're picking up your bow, at the end of the day, what you experience on the mountain is, is, a, is a priceless moment. Great friends, good people. I feel very blessed. Completely pushed out right now. We've been climbing all day. I did so hard. And this bull just kept escaping us. The rewards in the journey, and this has been an unbelievable journey so far. Typical, you know, what you would imagine or what I imagine in my mind is is Colorado Western elk hunting. You can hunt multiple types of terrain within the same unit in Colorado. It's it's the diversity is really, really exciting to see how the elk are gonna behave in you know high elevation versus versus low elevation. Just get up in there and see what we can come up with and hope that you know we run into some elk. So yeah, let's get after we're in a daylight. this cat literally looking in the same direction I'm looking and hunting the same thing with the same set of knowledge that I've got as a hunter and it just really it goes to show you how smart these things really are and and how they not only survive but they're thriving um, because they're such efficient hunters about bow hunting is you typically have a lot more intimate encounters with elk 
It's a place where you actually have to pierce their environment and to become part of an elk's environment in order to successfully harvest that animal. There's a bull bugle right here. Right above my Rifle hunting, you know, you can have those same types of encounters with elk. Best part about rifle hunting, too, you know, you just never know what you're going to encounter. It gives you a chance to see a lot more bulls, typically, because they're in bachelor herds again. So there's this huge diversity in a hunt with rifle hunting, and it's it's exciting for me always because you never know what you're going to get, and sometimes you can get both extremes on the same hunt. <coughs> to be in this moment. This moment is is incredible and, and I and I you know heck I I took the first the first bull that gave me a chance and, and he's stunning. Nice bull. I broke his wing doing fighting that's insane. And he broke his third too. It's a scrappy bull. <laughs> wow. When you write the book of of spectacular elk hunts or, or, or what you'd want to have on an elk hunt, I, I experience the thrill of everything in Colorado. It goes to show you, you never know what you're going to find. And, uh, you know, with these guys to bed just screaming and fighting and to get back on them today was, was pretty incredible. I, what, a, what a dream come true. 
it, it's awesome to, to be a part of an organization that does so much for wildlife. So it's been special, and I, you know, I'm, I'm just excited for you know, you know someday some other kids going to be standing sure. on this mountain, having the same experience. Uh, you know, or another person, you know, just having this same experience, and uh, that is awesome. Thank you so much. What a great trip.